Hi everybody. Hello there. I'm Jerry. And I'm Linda. We're the newcomers. You know, our channel, we try to bring you things that'll make your retirement life easier. As we get older, you know, we can't do all the things we used to do and sometimes we need a little help. Air conditioning, for example, I couldn't live without it. Yes. The TV? I couldn't live without it. <laughs> and you know, I've got my recliner, my little station out there. You've got your spot. Mm -hmm. The microwave. The microwave comes in so handy. And in a minute, you'll see what all this is leading to, but we're going to bring you a product that we think can revolutionize your life, can make your life so much easier. You know, the garage door opener. You remember the old days when <laughs> if you were lucky enough to have a garage, you had to get out of your car and go, I remember, I remember that. Now it's automatic. And good shoes. Oh my gosh, good shoes are so important. I used to be real picky about the price on shoes. I would buy cheap shoes in my old age here. I don't care what they cost. I just want shoes to make my feet feel comfortable. That's right. And things like a nice mattress. Yes, a good pillow. Uh, not much is more important than that. And cool sheets. Cool sheets, mm -hmm. a soft pillow. Mm -hmm. Today we're going to bring you a product that tops the list. It's a product I encountered 20 years ago in Japan. Gosh, it's been that long. <laughs> yeah, I'd never seen anything like it. It's called the Toto Washlet. Now they have all kinds of them. You know, they used to be called bidets, but today, today they're called the washlet and they still have bidets as well. But this is an addition to your existing toilet. It yeah. resembles a toilet yeah. seat, but you attach it to your toilet. And let me tell you, it can revolutionize your life. As people age, it can actually be a problem. <laughs> no, your flexibility is not what it used to be. Perhaps you're a little bit overweight. <laughs> You know, perhaps you have mobility issues, mm -hmm. or maybe you have arms like a Tyrannosaurus Rex. You know? <laughs> <laughs> if you have a wash, you won't need to adapt any of those. And let me say right now, we, to Toto Toilet or washlets do not even know we exist. No. We're doing this strictly because we think it is a product that if you can afford it, it, it can make your life easier. Mm -hmm. And the installation is fairly simple. We're going to give you a look at ours and you can judge for yourself. Remember the pandemic? Toilet paper was hard to get. We don't need it anymore. Let's take a look at ours and Jerry will show you the features. With the washlet, you use your existing toilet and you buy this unit that sits on top. I'm going to show it to you. You may have heard a moment ago the, the whirring sound. That is a deodorizer that's activated anytime you sit on the lid. And in fact, all these uh, controls that I'm going to show you in a moment, they are only activated when you sit on the lid, you know, sit on the toilet seat, and uh, then you can get the spray and what, whatever. But I'll show you those in just a second. Right now, I want to give you a look at the unit itself. It has a control panel over here with a stop a rear. If you push that rear twice, it gives you a pulsating action. The soft rear, if you prefer it a little bit softer, one for the very front and one for uh, a dryer. So what happens is you come in, as soon as you sit down, the deodorizer comes on and a pre-wash comes on. It swirls water around the tub to prevent those embarrassing skid marks you don't want your company to see. After you do your business, choosing either the soft wash or the little bit harder wash or the pulsating wash, then you'll turn on the dryer and it might take 30 seconds. You know, you're dry and the deodorizer will take care of everything and you're on your way. It's plastic. It's not meant to have heavy weights sit on top of this. It's really not meant for sitting. You don't want to sit on here. You know, somebody really light would be fine, but myself or, or any big guys, you wouldn't want to sit on that. It has a toilet seat. It's plastic. It is soft clothes. I don't know how we ever existed before we had soft clothes toilet seats. You ever go to a hotel and you slam the toilet seat while your wife or your roommate or whoever it is is in bed? Boom! That soft clothes is really nice. So it's lightweight plastic, both units. Here is the actual water tank. It's behind this. And when you activate the controls for the spray to come out, it comes out here, does its business. It's self-cleaning, so it's pretty cool. 
One thing you have to remember when you get a Toto toilet, you need an electrical outlet. It's back here. We paid an electrician to put that in. The plumbing itself is very simple. It's just some screw-ins. Not a big deal at all. You can do it yourself. But that's the whole unit in a nutshell. There's water stored in here. It has an instant water heater in there that you can select and it will warm up the water so you don't get that cold shock. But that's it. Let's take a look inside. I'll put some pressure on the toilet seat so that you can see the functions a little bit. I was just kidding there. That would not spray in that situation. You have to be actually sitting on the seat. Listen. Did you hear it come on? It's, it's watering the bowl right now. And the deodorizer is on. And now, technically, I could select any of the sprayers. And they would come on. But that's what prevents it from spraying out. You cover this hole when you're sitting. You don't get water in your bathroom. And it's very nice. And Jerry, don't forget, the seat is heated, the water can be heated, and the dryer can be heated. Or not heated if you don't want to. Right. And they have different pressures for the water. You can have high pressure or low pressure. That's right. We hang out here a lot. You know, we gather around the toilet. We have little <laughs> family meetings in here. Prayer meeting. <laughs> if you want one of these, they have varied prices. During COVID, they got real expensive. They did. But there are a lot of features. The only feature we don't have that might be nice would be a light. Some of them have a light that when you lift that toilet seat, or some are even motion activated. When you walk in, the seat will raise for you. Mm -hmm. How's that for dandy? Yeah. But that's, we don't have that or the light, but we don't feel like we need it. There are other brands too. That... There are other brands and we have friends that have the other brands and all we hear are complaints. Mm, they have a remote control. I don't think I'd want a remote control. Yeah. I think I'd be dropping that. <laughs> but like I said, in Japan, where the technology is king, this is the brand that they were using. Again, we don't get anything from, from mm. Toto. But they were really high during the pandemic. Right now, you could go in a store and buy them for between 300 400 and up, depending on how many features you wanted. We have one in both of our bathrooms. We figured if we were enjoying it, we'd let our guests enjoy it too. Well, we're often in this bathroom. If I'm in the living room, yeah. living area, I'll run to this bathroom more than I would go go back and check ours. But if you have a very occasional guest, we actually have a directions sheet that we put here on the side of the cabinet so they can figure out how to operate it. But it's a good thing. Uh, I, I love it in retirement, and I think you will too. If you liked our video today, please press that like and subscribe button and share it with all your friends. Until next time. See you when you get here. Unless I'm in here. Don't, no, don't come in here. <laughs>